everybody, what's up? So I just got home and I saw a new trailer for the upcoming movie Slender Man just got released. Uh, whoopee. Didn't we just get a Slender Man movie a couple of years ago? Anyways, this one stars Julia Goldani Tellis, Jess Sinclair, Annalise Basso from Ouija, Origin of Evil, and of course, Joey King. She was in The Conjuring, which was awesome, and Wish Upon, which was, well, I remember that turd. <laughs> now, I'm not one for easily forgiving people who literally destroy an hour and a half of my life. But I'm gonna try to move on. Slender Man is, of course, about the tall, thin, horrifying figure with unnaturally long arms and featureless face that's a huge urban legend and who is thought to be behind countless tauntings and disappearances of young children. I personally love horror movies. Even some of the worst horror movies still have redeeming qualities that make them, well, entertaining and watchable. So let's go ahead and get this one started, guys. Check it out, see what it looks Once like. Once you see him, you can't unsee him. Blow low, cute trailer. Okay. Twitter poll. If you could stay one age forever, what would it be? What about the age we are right now? Seriously? Sometimes I wish we could just get out of this stupid town together. The best actress in the movie goes missing. <laughs> that makes sense. That's what the cops ask you. I wanted to know if she ever talked about running away. Check this out. Here is the last site she visited. Yeah, stalker. Slender man. He preys on innocent youth. What was that? I think this is how we get Katie back. Those who hear the three bells toll accept his invitation. When you hear the first, you must close your eyes. Katie! Opening your eyes, only once you've heard the third. He gets in your head like a virus. Some he takes, some he drives mad. Once you see him, you can't unsee him. Okay, well, I'm not quite sure about that one. But let's talk about this urban legend. Slender Man is roughly eight feet tall, has no face, and of course, is slender. He can shapeshift, teleport, and become invisible, all while dressed to the nines in a suit and tie. He recruits proxies to do the dirty work for him. Some poor girl actually got caught up in a case of Slender Man worship when two 12-year-old girls tried to stab her to death, hoping to impress Slender Man and become proxies. Luckily, the girl survived, but this is also a reason why this movie is taking some heat from critics that say this could spawn copycats. CGI smoke. Ugh. I hate CGI in horror movies. Why? Why do they put this effect in every horror movie? It looks so dopey. Okay, okay, just stop now. This is absolutely unacceptable. What was the budget for this movie? This just looks awful. And the rest of this trailer just looks like a bunch of cuts of jump scares. I could be surprised though, but I'm gonna have to give this trailer a two out of five. It definitely isn't making me wanna go blow $15 on a ticket right away. So anyways guys, what did you think of this trailer? Leave a comment below and let me know. And as always, if you wanna be part of the adventure, hit that subscribe button and join the quest.